Greetings, my dear Reggie Rockles. It is I, your Lord Igneous here, and today I have very exciting news for the Pokemon community. We have an announcement of two new Pokemon, um, and their names are Yamper and Impidimp. Now, this was revealed in the E3 demo for um, <coughs> Pokemon Sword and Shield. In this demo, you uh, go through the water gym and you fight this person right here and uh... <clears throat> I'm gonna get busy tonight. No, I'm playing. Uh, uh, anyways, uh, so the Pokemon we have here. Oh my god, they are amazing. So this one right there is called Yamper. Now, Yamper is an electric type Pokemon. Yamper is a Corgi Pokemon. Its special ability, now get this is to retrieve failed Pokeballs. Yes, you can get a Pokeball back if it is failed for the first time. That's it. I think I think it's the first Pokeball from what I can remember. Anyway, so um I'm uh, I I cannot wait to catch this guy in the game. So yeah, so Yamper is an electric type Corgi Pokemon and I'm so excited that it's in here. Um the other Pokemon is called Impidim. <laughs> And this is this, 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 this fuck right here. I love this Pokemon. It's just, it's designed, it's great. It is a fairy dark type Pokemon. Now, this is a special type, as has never been done before. Also, it is a very good competitive Mon, if so. Um, a fairy is a pretty much OP type in Pokemon battles, and fairies are usually tanky. Now, dark types are really like attackers. So. This is if this is a tanky attacker, it's over. It's actually over. Impidimp just wins. Well, it's evolved form since it looks like the first Evo. But yeah, um, Yamper and Impidimp—they look really cool, and I can't wait for them. Um, though, unfortunately, um, there has been something going around. Um, <sighs> something called. Hashtag bring back the national decks. Game Freak has decided to um, eliminate the national decks um, from Pokemon Sword and Shield. Now, what this means, this means that they can choose certain Pokemon to eliminate or eliminate from the game. Now, we don't know what Pokemon. So what happens is, is that they're gonna choose some Pokemon, not even to code into the game. So what this means is that some Pokemon are unable to be transferred in the game. Like, unfortunately, I have a feeling Reggie Rock is not going to be um, catchable or tradable in Pokemon Sword and Shield, um, which is unfortunate because our God is not there however the negativity is the bad part so if you are up somebody on twitter going around like being negative and just being an asshole it's a fucking game dude like actually it's a fucking game like i'm i'm fucking serious it's a fucking game sorry um anyways so, the situation is that people are whining on Twitter, being a fucking child over this shit. Now, I get it. I understand why people are angry, but honestly, I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck about fucking the decks. I just want to play the fucking game for what it is outright, my guy. Seriously. Now, people are not even buying the game because of this shit. I'm buying the game because it looks fucking cool. I mean, honestly, the gameplay is one of the best parts about it. I just, I want to catch the new Pokemon. I want to use those on my team, not my fucking old ones back in fucking X and Y, for fuck's sake, dude. So, people are being really negative about this, like, horrifically negative. Like, they're telling off other people because they don't agree with their opinion to not buy the game. Like, okay, for example, I replied to my friend Foulplays, go subscribe to him, um, get him past 1k, I would love that for him. Um... Do you want a new Pokemon game? Okay, so he says, Do you want a new Pokemon game this year? Or do you want to wait till 2020? Stop being so ungrateful. Like, yeah, so, so this person, 
uh, or the, the, this tweet goes, everyone, please do not purchase or pre-order Pokemon Sword and Shield until they be, until they confirm all Pokemon are available. I want these games to be good, but without all Pokemon, simply well, that is the, that is the worst fucking thing I've ever heard. Uh, it having all the Pokemon doesn't make it a good game for fuck's sake you fucking clown oh my god anyway so um he's telling him to go over it so I replied stop whining like children seriously I don't even care if it has Reggie Rock I'm still buying it because it looks dope the gameplay is what makes it good not the fucking Pokemon get a hold of yourselves I thought we were past this we're not fucking four years old alright fuck off dude Oh my god, how about, eh, for fuck's sake, dude. Anyway, so yeah, my point is, if you want the game because of the gameplay and just everything about it, please buy the game. Just buy the game, man. It looks amazing, okay? Who cares if, like, fucking, they fucking Thanos snapped the, half the fucking Pokedex. I don't care. I want to use new Pokemon. I want it, I'm not it for the experience, Okay? If I want to play my old Pokemon, I'll just whip out my fucking 3DS and start going fucking. Okay? If you want fucking Kanto, go play Let's Go, you fucking. Actually, don't play Let's Go. That's a... that's bad. <sighs> I've been ranting about this for eight minutes. Anyways, so yeah, that's that's about it, really. I mean, I got nothing else to say. I just wanted to update you guys on what's going on here. My thing is, I would m rather have all the Pokemon back, but I, I'm still gonna buy the game, like, I don't even care, it's just, it would be preferred to do it, but, okay, look, I would prefer to have them add them back as, like, a patch or something, as, like, a fix, like, saying, hey, I'm sorry, guys, and I'm still buying the game because I want to support Game Freak for everything they've done to me, for everything they've done, like, they are one of the best game studios, like, ever. Like, Pokemon is a part of it. It's in here. And just because they Infinity Ward half the Pokédex, like, I don't care, man. Like, I actually don't care. I just I want to play their new game and see how good it is. You know? Doesn't everybody? So, yes. <sighs> just play it, man. I mean, who cares if some Pokemon are gone? I don't care, to be honest. Yeah, sum everything up. Again, I would prefer them to release all the Pokemon back, but, uh, I would play the game anyway without them, because, you know, it just, I want to see the new Pokemon, and I want to use them. They look cool, you know? And, like, stop whining on Twitter just because you can't use your fucking Arbok or fucking Golem, dude. It's the way it is. It's life, man. If you want your old Pokemon go back, go play fucking Let's Go, dude. Or fucking Sun and Moon. I don't care, dude. Just stop making the community toxic again. I thought we we're supposed to get past it. So yeah, so just stop being toxic and just stop whining like a baby. Keep everything to yourself, man. I mean, just stop being a fucking child is what I'm trying to get at, alright? Just chill, man. It's a fucking game, dude, alright? God damn it. <sighs> Thank you all so much for watching. I'm going to do a Road to 1K Alien Isolation stream soon, pretty soon. Ha! Huh? Huh. I just said soon like fucking twice. What the fuck am I doing? Um, yeah, so. Yeah, thank you. Thank God my webcam is recording my microphone. Holy shit, I just realized I wasn't recording on OBS. What the fuck, dude? Oh my God. Okay, I'm gonna... <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching, man. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you later, my dear Reggie Rockles. Please, praise, praise Lord Reggie Rock.